This is the basque weave stitch. It's created by alternating front post double crochets with back post double crochets. Let me show you how. So see these horizontal lines here in the square? That's created by the back post double crochet. So in order to switch it up and create vertical lines on top of those horizontal lines for the basque weave stitch, we are going to work front post double crochets. So we're going to work four front post double crochets on top of these four back post double crochets. And the front post double crochet is a lot like a normal double crochet except for where you put your hook. So you're wrapping your hook behind that stitch in the row below and then otherwise just working a double crochet like normal. So this is our last front post double crochet. And now we have worked four front post double crochet. And then see how we have vertical lines here? In order to create horizontal lines on top of them, we're going to work the back post double crochet into the next four stitches. 